After nearly four decades of rule by a man who turned from independence hero to African strongman, Robert Mugabe finally steps down and Zimbabweans could not be happier. Wild celebrations broke out at a joint sitting of parliament when Speaker Jacob Mudenda read out Mugabe's resignation and suspended the impeachment procedure. I Out on the streets of Harare, people cheered, danced and shook hands with members of the armed forces. While parliament prepared for impeachment proceedings, calls increased for Mugabe to step down. From the War Veterans Association, to leader of the main opposition, the Women for Democratic Change, Morgan Changarai, and from the country's youth who had waited outside the parliamentary building as lawmakers prepared to deliberate. We have ruled for 37 years. We don't want you another 37 seconds. Please. Go away, go, 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 Mugabe, go. Now, the question is, how do we end Mugabe? News of Mugabe's resignation filtered throughout the rest of the world. UK Prime Minister Theresa May said Mugabe's resignation was an opportunity to forge a new path free of the oppression that characterized his rule. The US Embassy called the resignation historic, saying it is an opportunity for the nation to set itself on a new path that will lead to free and fair elections. Amarachi Ubani, Channel Television News.